Hey everyone, in this video, let's do a review of Lura AI. In order to do so, here we are at Lura.com, and according to AI, Lura is an AI-powered English learning app that provides real-time conversational practice and instant feedback. It's generally considered a good tool for enhancing English fluency, especially for users seeking conversational practice, with users praising its accessibility and interactive nature. However, it's also been noted that Lura's reliance on AI may not fully replicate the depth and precision of human interaction, and some users have noted instances where the AI's responses were inaccurate or biased. Here is a more detailed breakdown of Lura's strengths and weaknesses. Lura excels at providing real-time conversational practice, allowing users to engage in dialogues and receive immediate feedback on their pronunciation, grammar, and fluency. The app is available 24-7, making it convenient for users to practice English at their own pace and schedule. Lura uses gamification elements and interesting topics to keep users motivated and engaged in their language learning journey. The app provides personalized feedback on pronunciation, grammar, and vocabulary, helping users identify areas for improvement. And Laura is generally more affordable than hiring a private tutor, making it accessible to a wider range of learners. Laura's primary limitation is its reliance on AI, which may not fully replicate the nuances and precision of human interaction. Laura doesn't offer structured lessons or video content, which may be essential for learners seeking a more comprehensive learning experience, and some users have reported instances where Laura AI's responses were inaccurate or reinforced biases. Laura's user interface seems to place a strong emphasis on pronunciation, which may not be as crucial for fluency as grammar for some users. In conclusion, Laura can be a valuable tool for enhancing English fluency through conversational practice and interactive feedback, particularly for those seeking affordable and accessible learning opportunities. However, users should be aware of its limitations, such as its reliance on AI and the potential for inaccuracy or biases in its response. And that's all there is to it. If you found this video helpful, please leave a comment and like and subscribe. And don't forget to set your notifications for more helpful tips. Also, if you take a look in the link in the description, you will find a link to our link tree. There you'll find our top AI tool recommendations. Click on any of those links to get started. You'd be helping us out as well, and we would greatly appreciate it.